Hey, what's up guys? Um, today I got a quick uh, review actually of an item that I got recently from uh, the guys at Chinatown Tactical. So they sent me, actually they sent it for a giveaway that you know is gonna go on for my 1,500 subscriber, which about to end up by the way. Um, they sent me uh, one, well, one of their items they carry in the website, a bunch of other things. They sent me well, one bag which is a range bag actually from Drago Gear of course and it is the Hammo and Tool Bag uh, really nice I mean like everything Drago makes um, I was impressed by the quality of course and I have to say it's uh, it's an interesting product like I said it can be an ammo and or range bag uh, even tool bag if you want to keep in your car with a bunch of tools that you might need in an emergency um, if I was buying something like that, it would be probably for range for myself because most of the range bags they tend to be kind of flimsy. But this one is actually really nice. Um, let's go and have a look about it, okay? Uh, the handles are really nice. I don't know what they use inside, uh, but they're really sturdy, which is normally uh, a weak point for, for a tool bag. They're always flimsy and they move all the one. These ones are really sturdy and they give you a lot of support. And they have some nice stitches and they attach it all on the bag, so it makes really firm and it's not going anywhere there is a, a central zip if you can see again really nice stitches um, it's like pretty resistant pretty durable which is normally a problem with a bunch of, of these tool bags they tend to break zip tend to break so um, and in the front I'm assuming that's the front um, you have a, a couple of small pouches for small items like rain stuff like I don't know hair protection and some small tools uh, that you might need over there, uh, your ID or something like that, your phone if you're drained, you don't want to uh, lose it. And then you got some mesh, which you can probably consider aside and put some air plugs. Mm, I don't think you can put your air protection, but air plugs, and again, small stuff that need to be fine right away. I don't know, even, and you got the same exactly thing on the other side. So you can put uh, even your car keys or stuff like that, um, little tool kit, uh, cleaning kits, something like that. And, um, Inside, I have to say that uh, that is the classic uh, that we saw previously on the backpack that I reviewed a while ago. Um, rubberized material which make it water resistant at least, so you can protect your item. And uh, you have uh, two, in, a, in these two sides that correspond with the flaps, two big pouches. We can probably put in this one your protection for sure. And then you got two series of three pouches, one inside and one the other side. Well, you can probably put magazine and what else. There's plenty of room in the center, and everything is really bad. Well, uh, like I said before, really well stitched. There is probably some kind of reinforcement. I don't know if it's cardboard or plastic. It makes uh, makes it difficult to um, destroy the bag per se, which is um, a common problem. The corner, which is normally a weak spot, too, really seems to be again really sturdy. And uh, all considered, it seems like it'd be a nice bag. Um, like I said, once you keep it open, that's a cool thing, like a, a tool bag in general. When you keep it open, actually, you can use access and won't close, which is a problem sometimes, because you keep trying to find something and the bag keep closing. Uh, with this one, you, you actually don't have that problem. It's open, so if you have the range, you want to access something very quickly, you are free to go. Uh, like I said, that was a quick overview of the Drago, Drago, Ammo and Tool Bag. If you can see the number. And you can find it at uh, dragovia.com, all information about it. And if you want to purchase one, you should go and check out my friend and at uh, Chai Town Tactical. I'm gonna leave the link of both company underneath the video. That's it guys, let me know if you want to know anything else about it. Uh, it's a really interesting product. I think you need a decent range bag. Uh, otherwise you're gonna lose all your stuff around, you know, and you keep trying to find something. It seems like very well made and quite well um, adjustable to your preference okay so guys I'll see you next time you stay tuned okay take